The Morning Ramble with Original Engravings by John R. Bowles Mother, come hither, dearest Adeline, come hither, child, to me. Have you been in the garden playing with the hummingbird and bee? Beside my open window I heard your voice of song and saw your little bonnet mid the tall flowers pass along. Come hither to your mother, and rest a while and talk of the pleasant things that you have seen and gathered in your walk. Adeline, mother, the birds sang sweetly on the branches of the trees, and I smelt the breath of roses upon the morning breeze, and this damask one so dewy beside the path I found. It sprang up gaily on the stem and smiled at all around. And this lily of the valley grew beside it in the bed. It rested in its leaf of green and bowed its pretty head. Mother They are beautiful, my daughter, and if like the rose you smile, you must as innocent and free from vanity and guile. And if you like the bashful lily, you look upon the earth, you must have beneath its bashful look its sweet and stainless worth. The lovely flowers are teachers, if rightly understood, and makes us many a gentle hint to make us wise and good. And now, my little Frederick, about your ramble tell. The sunshine in the morning breeze, have you enjoyed them well? Upon the lofty hillside, or in the spangled vale, where you drank the splendor of the sun and the freshness of the gale. If you ran so fast for pleasure through the clover and the dew, did you obtain the treasure, or has it flown from you? Frederick. Twas a butterfly I followed, all speckled with gold and green, the handsomest and largest that ever I had seen. I followed it through the garden, and I chased it over the hill. And sometimes I almost touched it, but it kept before me still. At length I sprang and caught it, as it sat upon a flower to rest, and I saw the shining colors with which its wings were dressed. I was going to bring it home, mother, for you to see it too. Such handsome streaks upon it, all green and gold and blue. But it tried to fly away from me, and some of the green and gold cut like dust upon my fingers, where I was taking hold. I did not want to hurt it, and so I let it fly away, and it went off, glad and beautiful, among the flowers to play. Mother and that was right, my Frederick, more pleasant far to me, that simple act of kindness, than the butterfly could be. Play freely in the garden bowers, and in the pastures wild, but let no harmless creature fear the coming of my child. Let all things sport in freedom, as God has made them too, and from all ensnaring evils may he deliver you. Now take your books, my Frederick, and yours, my Adeline, and hasten cheerfully to school, for it is almost nine. May your lessons all be pleasant, and see if you can learn something you never knew before to tell when you return. Speak words of truth, be gentle, in all you do or say, and the sweetness of the morning will be with you all the day. Child Song I love the dandelions, and the daisies white the sweet honeysuckles, and the buttercups bright. I love all the pretty flowers, and the green grass and clover, and to run about for hours the whole field over. I like the yellow butterflies, and those with spotted wings, the hummingbird, the robin, and every bird that sings. Their flight on the breeze is so graceful and airy, and their music in the trees is so sweet and so merry. The End